Hi, this is just a quick product review for the Flip Minnow HD. I uh, wanted to show you a little bit about it. I'm currently filming with one, and I'm also going to open a box and show you what's in a new one. So here we go. So this is the Flip Minnow HD. Let me first get the box. It's just a small box, opens up. You've got your Flip right there. You can pull it out, you can see it's got a, a nice lens there, it's got a little cover on it, and the back, simple features, you push the button right here that turns it on, and then all of these buttons here are just touch buttons, um, so it's wanting me to, to set up things, do some settings, so you can kind of see in the screen what I'm seeing, so there's not much to see, there we go. So a fruit basket. Um, these are all touch sensitive buttons except for the middle one which is an actual push button and that's the that's the record button. Uh, one of the greatest things, one of the greatest features about the Flip Minnow and, and all the Flip products in general is um, the, the USB connection. It comes right out and you're able to plug it straight into a computer, um, into a laptop. You're also able to put it um, directly into um, a Blu-ray player or DVD player that has a USB and you're able to play it um, right on your TV. Um, I personally have, have done that with this Flip Minnow. I've hooked it up to a 42 inch LCD TV. Quality looks great. It's, it's definitely not um, extremely high quality um, which you can't really expect too much from a small uh, little handheld device like this where there's not a lot of room for a lens but for for the size um, it, it's really great it's a little bit uh, a little bit taller than a deck of cards I wish I had one actually I do have a first generation iPhone with me so um, I'll show you in comparison to that so in comparison to a, a first generation iPhone, this is the the size difference. So it's a little bit thicker than the original iPhone, but it's also a little bit shorter. And when you look at how wide it is, it's oh, there we go. It's skinnier. So all in all, you look at the the two devices. They're similar in size, but the, the flip is is smaller in every dimension except for the actual thickness. You can see that the flip's a little bit thicker. Um, I, I absolutely love the flips. I know that there are tons of other um, handheld video uh, camcorders out there. Um, and, and flip has a, has a good reputation, has a good brand name and everything, but um, I, I don't necessarily know how it compares to all of the other brands out there but I know that for um, for the money that you pay for these flips they really are a good quality product especially um, I bought I bought this one um, on eBay refurbished for uh, for seventy dollars so they're, they're not very expensive great quality they do record in 720 HD so if you're uh, trying to consider which type of uh, handheld small camcorder you should get um, should think about the flip. Also in the package, uh, you obviously have your instruction manuals and everything, um, but then it also comes with a strap and it comes with a, a carrying case, which is of a, a very soft material for you know, wiping the lens or cleaning it. Um, so those are, those are good things that it comes with for sure. And then it also comes with an AV cable that you can plug it into a TV. Um, and on the device itself, somewhere there, down there at the bottom, is the, the AV out so that you can plug it into a, um, into a TV. It doesn't have an HDMI output. I know a lot of them nowadays are starting to have those. Um, this one does not. But all in all, it's a fantastic product, and I would recommend it. I hope that you enjoyed this video. There's me again. So have yourself a... A great night or a great day, whatever time it is, and uh, hopefully this will help convince you to buy a flip camcorder. And this once again, this is the Flip Minnow HD.